Hey, everybody. Welcome again to our channel, Next Success One. Hope all of you are doing great. Today, we're going to go over a step-by-step -step guide to writing a business plan. Make sure to watch until the end because it's one of the most amazing profitable business ideas I've ever seen. Let's jump right into the video. A business plan is the most important part of any successful business, but it's also one of the most time-consuming, tedious things to do. I'm going to show you how to write a business plan in three hours or less. You'll spend more time doing your taxes than you will creating this document that can help guide your future decisions. So let me break down all the steps for you so that you're ready when it's crunch time. If you're an entrepreneur or business owner, chances are you've heard about the importance of writing a formal business plan. But if your idea is still in its infancy stages, it can be hard to know where to start. In this video, I'll show you how to take any idea and write out a detailed three-hour business plan. 1. Create an outline of your business. 2. Determine funding sources. 3. Research competitors. 4. Write a 10-page business plan that tells the world about your idea but hides some of it from would-be competitors. 5. Use only one hour per week on your business and have more time for friends and family. 6. Launch a successful startup today. Here's a list of things you need to do this. A computer with internet access. One hour of uninterrupted time where you can write everything out or type it into a document. The desire to become rich beyond all dreams of avarice. This is optional, but suggested. Let's get started. Step 1. Create an outline of your business. This is where you come up with the idea of the business and whether or not it will be successful. Example, my idea for my business is to sell oranges online. People can place an order for them on my website, pay me using their credit card, and I will ship them oranges overnight. The people that buy oranges will get fresh fruit in less than 24 hours while avoiding the hassle of going to a store and spending time looking for orange juice. I believe this company could make $6 million per year within five years because there are many health-conscious people who will pay extra money to get fresh fruit delivered quickly. More people are thinking about their health, with many restaurants even offering healthy menu items. So this business provides a solution to people who want the convenience of finding healthy food in public places without having to leave their homes or offices. I believe that no major company currently offers this service because it's expensive to buy oranges in bulk and ship them overnight. That's why I'm going to capitalize on this opportunity by starting my own business. Your business could be anything, from an online blog that makes money through advertising to a physical location where you sell something. The most common types of businesses are retail stores. Internet-only retailers, wholesale distributors, product manufacturers, professional services like law firms, consulting firms, 
entertainment companies. Determine funding sources. Once you have a business plan in place, the next step is to identify potential funding sources. The best way to do this is to reach out to your local bank or small business administration office for advice. They can help you connect with financing programs that are tailored specifically to small businesses. Lesson Summary In this lesson, you learned the steps involved in creating a business plan for your business idea. Here's a quick recap. Use a brand name generator to choose a brandable name that is memorable and easy to say. Write out your mission statement, which defines what you hope to achieve with your new business. Outline each step of your startup process, from coming up with an idea to prepping for launch. After you write the main body of your business plan, write out an executive summary or introduction that quickly outlines who you are and what you do. Lesson Review What have we covered? Here's a review of what we've learned so far. Research competitors. Research the competition. Your goal when researching competitors is to write down specific information about who your competitors are, where they are, what they're selling, prices, any issues with the business, and how you're going to overcome them. Now, write a list of friends and associates who will make up your target market. Finally, write down any competitive advantages. For example, location, size, resources that you may have over the competitors in your industry. 1. Determine why you need a business plan. 2. Outline what your business is going to sell. 3. Make an outline for how the business operates. 4. Create financial projections for three years into the future. Evaluate three different scenarios or variants that may happen along that time frame. 5. Write out a descriptive marketing strategy, including advertising plans, pricing strategies, and sales efforts. The more detail you write here means less adjustments once it's written down on paper. Use only one hour per week on your business and have more time for friends and family. When you're starting a business, it's important to set aside time each week to work on it. But that doesn't mean you have to spend all your time on it. By using just one hour a week, you can write a business plan that will help propel your startup forward. The first thing you need to do is write down all of your ideas for the business, no matter how crazy they may seem at this point. Then start thinking about how each idea can be put into concrete actions and list out these steps for each one. Once you have a simple framework set up, start brainstorming ways in which customers might respond to your business in both positive and negative ways. Once you have everything in place, write it all down so that when people ask what's going on in the business, you can show them what you're doing instead of just talking about it. It will also help others understand the direction of the company better. Launch a successful startup today. In this video, I'll show you how to write a business plan in three hours. Making money can be really hard, 
And it's even harder if we're doing something we don't enjoy. And that's why we need to find a common ground between what we love and what we're good at. So write down your passion and write down your skills and see where they overlap and boom. You're writing a business plan for your new successful startup. To write a business plan, we need to write down this information. How much our company is worth in equity and valuation. How much money we generate monthly. Who our main customers are and how much they spend on average per month. What the market size is. What our unique selling point, USP, is. Why somebody would choose us over the other guys in the market. You write this info out by creating a product market fit matrix, where you write down your idea for each section of your business plan. Once you have everything written down, all you have to do next is to write it up into a formal business plan using my unique template. Here are some other courses you can take to write your business plan even faster. How to write a book in one hour video series. How to write an ebook in five hours video series. How to start a company in three hours video course. You can do it too. Now go ahead and write your business plan. Business plans are an essential document, but they can be time-consuming to write. Most people don't know where to start or how to write one. You might think that you need an MBA or years of experience before you can write a good business plan. But this is not the case at all. There are plenty of free resources available online that will help you get started. And in this video, I'll show you how to take any idea and write out a detailed three-hour business plan.